Welcome to another video and today we are at Topaz Detailing. But by now you guys have seen the delivery of my SVJ, I hope you like it. But this video will outline the preparation and the process the car went through before being delivered. We are at Topaz to actually see the process um, of what has been going on with the SVJ. Parts of it has been completed, parts of it still needs to be done. So I'm gonna come and check it out. It is a new car and many will ask why you have a new car detail. There are many, many reasons which I will outline later on in the video, but for now, this place always excites me because they have some serious machines here. Let's go check it out. Oh, man. How are you, yeah. champ? Good. You okay? You? Sorry to just yeah, walk yeah. up into your garage. I know you don't like, uh, like that sort of stuff, but wow, I was just briefing these guys. You probably have seen the video many a time before on YouTube videos, but this is my part. Um, Congrats. I've just, Congrats. Thank Amazing. you so much. Well, these guys have just seen it. Yeah, they've, yeah. They've, they, the, the previous video to this was the delivery of it, but I was just telling them outside why I wanted to send my special car um, here, it's a brand new car and it's being prepared by Topaz and there's so much to it and that's why I wanted to just come by and show them it. I was super excited in the video, I must have been. Yeah. I'm talking to the future right now. <laughs> you know, it's it's just looking so glossy, the the, the lines and everything, yeah, yeah. it's just yeah, yeah. amazing. What have you done with it so far? Well, I mean, what we've done so far, we've paint corrected it. Yep. So we've done two to three stages of paint correction throughout the whole oh. car. Um, this is a really, really cool color. Obviously, it's a pearlescent color, very special, but it needs a lot to make it look even better. Yeah. So you can't, you can't get a, you can't just do a couple quick things and then afterwards you get a good result from it. It doesn't work that way. Exactly. It, 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 it's, it's a very, very bespoke color. It's very. I mean, the way it looks is amazing. The pop is phenomenal. But now, as you can see, it looks even better. Yeah, right, so, so much better. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is something that I've known for a while, that when you get a car brand new from a manufacturer, no matter how good the manufacturer is, um, they all seem to have their imperfections in certain places. For some people, they might think that uh, you know, we're being petty at the smallest of mistakes, but when you're spending um, 400,000 pounds plus on a, on a vehicle, you want, you want it right. to be absolutely yeah, yeah, yeah. perfect. 100%. It's your pride and joy, 100%. it's your love. Uh, and it's not only expensive cars that come here, yeah, yeah, yeah. There, is, there, is, there is normal cars that yeah, come here right. as well yeah, all yeah, the time, yeah, because yeah. it's what, if you, if you are passionate about your vehicle and you pride your vehicle and you're yeah. in love with your vehicle, you want the best treatment and the the best setup for it for the longevity of its we of had life. a Peugeot 205 believe it or not yeah, <laughs> no was, way yeah that was it we went through all the detail went through a signature detail the whole lot it depends so, you're absolutely right so but this is the thing so now that's been prepped mm. uh, it's got some film on it wow uh, we're going through different stages of film Oof, look at the reflections yeah it's amazing, huh? So that it's protected. That's the cool thing about it. And I can't. And that's what I'm struggling to see. That's what I'm actually trying to see, right? Yeah, I can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, wow. And there's so much Everything light matters. in here as well yeah. that you would bound. You're bound to see it. I've tried out some companies, yeah, right? Yeah, of uh, course, yeah. And, and and you know that. But uh, since we got the taste with the with, yeah. with the first car with the Urus, yeah, Urus. Yeah, I mean, yeah. after that, it was yeah. just it was plain and simple. And yeah. that's why you I knew the from there, yeah. the SVJ had to have that naked PPF. And this is. I don't want people to come up to my car and, and see, oh look, it's protected or it's got something on it or yeah, anything yeah. like that. This is invisible and that's the whole point of it. It's like, why would you want to cover it? And then it also is going to be protected like this. Well, this is the thing about us. So obviously we originated from detailers. So we're a detailing company. That's why we talk about detailing, right? But when paint protection film came on the market, it wasn't to the level that we were happy with. So we wanted to make sure that not only it protects the paint, I wanted to make sure that aesthetically, from a detailer's perspective, from my eyes, it looks good as well. Mm -hmm. So that's really important from my perspective. And that's why you see But now, the level to get to this, there's many, many factors that 
come a part of this it's it's the facilities you use and some people may think well you can just do it anywhere yeah. dust free environments the air being clean everything yeah. because the smallest amount of dust in underneath the PPF can just ruin the finish of it right, right. yeah exactly and, and then when it comes down to joints and stuff like that yeah. there the best patterns. there are patterns everything's been done by us bespoke you mean so it's not something that I can get off a pattern I can get off the shelf and cut out you can see how many areas it has how many uh, sections it has because of all the aerodynamics and so. another thing Nabil as well that uh, we were going to do but we've scrapped it now we were going to do a color match caliper but then we changed our mind the gray the silver mm. works so well with that with the color it just I breaks it down a little yeah, bit yeah. otherwise it would have got too dark around around the wheel yeah for sure for sure definitely oh that's the first time i've seen the the light illuminated oh yeah yeah <laughs> wow it is cool i mean it's it's i was telling this to you earlier it's a brave color but honestly if there is one car that can pull it off, is this car. Yeah. Really, That's, honestly. But, but, but you know when people say, oh, what colour should I get my Lamborghini in? It's, it's one, of the car, one of the manufacturers that you can just, they can just pull off any colour. Yeah, because yeah. every, every colour has its own mood and changes the car to the mood. Um, but I, I love it. Look, look I mean, a, a colour, a bespoke colour where I've spent many thousands of pounds working with Lamborghini, developing this colour, applying it to, you know, and, and the finish. It was only right that, you know, we had to do this kind of treatment on the car to get it into its yeah. uh, its 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 best shape. Yeah, and that's directly from. I remember obviously from the directly from the dealer straight to us. Yes, right? exactly. So a lot of people make that mistake. They drive the car. They can't wait. Mm. They drive the car a little bit and they pick up a chip and then it's. But it's not only detailed. So it's 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 going to be like this for like a week or two. The PPF, the paint protection film. Um, it's self-healing, so when it does get smear marks, so I can take this to a car wash. Let's say I have to go to an event and I'm doing a road trip and there's a local car wash nearby, but it's not exactly the best car wash, but it's the, it's the only one in like a 20 mile radius, yeah. then boom, you have to go to it. Yeah. But you haven't got to worry that your paint is getting damaged or yeah. scratched because it's yeah. PPF on it. So exactly. if the PPF is on it, they can give it a good wash, they can do whatever they got to do. And then later on, when it comes back to base, all I've got to do is either that when the sun's out, it gets a good buff, or yeah. if you get a heat gun onto it, very yeah lightly do it and buff it over and it self heals and the car stays glossy again and right. the lacquer is yeah. permanent the PPF is not yeah, um, exactly. and with this also we're also putting on the ceramic coating on top of it there you go yeah. double whammy yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we have the Cullinan arriving so unfortunately we couldn't video that because the car is actually going to be delivered tomorrow and that will have a full d-chrome so right. in in topaz skin but Nabil will explain all about that later very excited about that in a weird way I'm actually more excited about the, what they are going to do with the Cullinan than they are with the PPF because I've kind of experienced the PPF process before as well with on the on the Urus you and know on the field. Yeah. yeah yeah but I, you know it I know I know the job so this is more for you guys but the Cullinan is something that I'm I'm really anticipating and cannot wait to see because Rolls-Royce quality I expect a mirror finish and the only way to de-chrome chrome and keep it still chrome underneath is to wrap it or to skin it and wrapping gloss black is not the best kind of finish because you see a lot of imperfections in it whereas Topaz skin will be like paint like once they've sanded it down wet sanded it down polished it it'll be like a mirror like finish but we'll let the video do the talking when that when that's done yeah, and we'll, we'll, sure. Nabil's going to show us a, a rendering um, a configuration of the Cullinan uh, on his computer yeah, I exactly. hope. Yeah, but yeah looking. that's the car so this is yeah. the process actually that we we, we we put the car through it's not as simple as boom boom it's got to be uh, collected there's a lot of prep a lot of PDI going into into cars so if you love your car and if you uh, really have a special looking car like with a special paint uh, or for whatever reason you want to cherish it for a longer time I have my uh, I have a Porsche Cayenne uh, a 2006 done 70,000 miles it's looking a little bit worse for where it's always been outdoors never been paint protected or anything and maybe I might even get that uh, detailed and protected it's probably worth like 10k 11k but you know sometimes uh, you have uh, sentimental things that you just want to make sure that they look proper for longevity yeah exactly what you say normally Armin longevity over clout So guys, the cover on the SVJ on the back of the engine, you actually have to lift it off. You can't just raise it up with some struts. So as you can see here, they've taken it off.
It's like a, a barber, right? Yeah. A barber always has the worst hair because he, a good barber because he never has time to cut it. <laughs> my, my excuse with this is that I just came back from Nurburgring. Oh so wow! So I took it on the Nurburgring and then I came back and I haven't had time to. You cut know, it. so it's so it's so nice to hear that you uh, are using your cars and displaying the fact that look. This is a Pisa, it's a very special car, it holds a lot of value. And a lot of people don't drive these or the way that they should be used because they worry about value. But if you protect the car correctly, yeah. if you, you know, it's, it just goes to show you are uh, you, you are confident in your product and you're yeah. using it. It's evident. The guy went to the Nurburgring yeah, yeah. in his pista. I would never. I promise you, I might take it to a racetrack, but I'm not taking it to the Nurburgring. The Nurburgring is uh, is something else, and probably I, I probably need a lot of driver training for that. Everybody keeps talking about my silly bag right here, but it helps with my road mic <laughs> strapped on, so that's why I actually wear it. <laughs> Shout out AAV Media for the road. <laughs> so it's solid black. Yep. Right, so that's the paint. It's black. Let's do the wheels. Now, if we go for wheels, I'm also, you're blacked out wheels as well. Yes, right? yeah. So the wheels will be blacked out. But uh, we've got the Forgiatas arriving, yeah, this is what it looks course. like from factory. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So again, it'll be black wheels on that. And now let's go down to, let's have a look at the chrome side of things. As you can see, guys, there is a lot there of go. chrome on the car. Wow. There you go. That's just been de-chromed. So as you can see, if I toggle that between chroming and de-chroming, you see all that section there is, you can have a look at it. So you can see here the chrome on the grill. Yeah. Yeah, and then you got the chrome here, you got this chrome strip here. Yeah, that's all going on. All of this. Yeah, exactly. All of that, all so of that, yeah, the even, door handles. Yeah, we're, we're still deciding about this one at the moment because about the RR badges. So, the way I've done it is. Oh, yeah, you've actually done a part of it. Around it, exactly. So, the way I've done it is, is I've done it so that it's literally around it, but the RR, I've left it as it is because then you can see the yes. RR. Shows, oh, you, shows you how much there is chrome. a lot of chrome at the back. Yeah, 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 you see, that all goes. Yeah, big difference. I'm even done. I've also did the the surrounds of the of the exhaust as well because I think you just you know you have to do it. Incredible. Uh, yeah, and then I mean if you want to see complete what, back blackout. If, if you want to see what it looks like in Rosso Corsa. Oh, now you're really <laughs> playing with me. What Rosso Corsa, a Ferrari red color. Yes. That looks amazing. All blacked out. Incredible. That's yeah. the look I always wanted. So the company is AA Visuals. They're the ones who did the software for me, and wow. they've done an amazing job. There you go. If you ever do any off-roading. Wow. <laughs> AAV Media and AAV Visuals. What's going on here, mate? Like, that is not you. <laughs> <laughs> you see that? So that that shows you what it looks like if you're off-roading. <laughs> but as if you will ever off-road it. Wow. And also, you can change the time of day. So you got an idea. So you see the. Well, time? you say as if you're not gonna be off-roading, but yeah. If you, you actually gonna... look at Ed Sheeran's video that he's just dropped today, yeah. there's a Cullinan in the field. Oh, really? Yeah, being like, oh, just yeah, swung around. Yeah, so he took it off off-roading. Yeah, <laughs> the sun is just going to show you on the front wing how it hits. It looks like it needs a Topaz level 5, though. Yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly, you see? That's just, that's just it. But, but I mean, to give you an idea, look at that. The reflections. It gives you an idea with the sun. Hitting it, but yeah, I love it. So it's cool. Um, is it possible to have a look at uh, the SVJ? Yeah, yeah. Let's have a look. Let's go with Ruby, Ruby? for the demonstration. Yeah. yeah. Okay, fine. Let's just put Ruby in. Race car feel. Nah. Race car vibe, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's oh. nuts. That does look nuts. That looks mad. I can, I can, all, I already know what my rally wrap is going to be. We're going to use this as a basis, and then we're going to highlight it with some silver or white light tire writing. Or so, oh, it's going to be crazy. But you can see a menacing look can be achieved by doing the other parts as well, and bearing in mind um, that the quality of this will just be like paint, and I can also preserve and protect my paint underneath it and reverse it back whenever I need to so very excited about this very excited for the work that's going to be carried on onto the Cullinan we've got a little carried away as you can tell from the length of this video with the playing around on this configurator yeah. but it's very important that I show you all of this because um, it's uh, it's 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 nice but I mean that, that that looks that looks mega huh doesn't that look good that looks nuts. You know, the thing is, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even thinking towards it right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I just want to enjoy it as it is purple, yeah, yeah, yeah. but I know deep down what is about to come.
Okay, Nabil, so thank you so much for showing me around. In fact, you've shown me around many a time, but yeah, thank yeah, you so yeah. much for showing um, my, uh, my followers and my subscribers around. Um, and it's I cannot wait always. for the job. Thank you so much for everything. I know that we're working very, very hard to kind of meet uh, yeah, yeah. certain dates and we were going to do a dual car delivery, but um, obviously, you know, you're already, the, the car's only arriving. You're only going to get, it's bank holiday Monday now, so you're only going to start it on Tuesday. So right, yeah, I guess yeah. you're limited on time and, are, uh, and, you, and, and you're pushing yourself. So I really appreciate that. So I can't yeah. wait to do the Cullen collection from here. Uh, when it's all finished, but I for now, I can't wait to see it. I can't wait to see it. I can't wait to see what it's going to look like blacked out. Yeah, and wait. it's going to be the first Rolls Royce yep. that Topaz Skin have done a D chrome on as well. Exactly. Championship exactly. stuff. <laughs> Brother, thank you all so right. much for your see time, you man. Take That's care. Nabil, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, guys, there we have it. We've just checked out Topaz detailing and Topaz skin. Um, you know what my SVJ is now here for um, and how it's been prepped and how my Cullinan is going to be prepared as well. Very excited about the outcome. Um, always a pleasure visiting Topaz. Make sure you check out their work. Uh, and again, a great addition to the automotive industry, especially with maintaining and uh, enhancing the look of your vehicle. Now, um, that's it for today. Make sure you subscribe, share, and like. There is a... Uh a 4x4 squared, <laughs> casual. Uh, make sure you subscribe, share, and like for more content. Follow me on Instagram as well, lordaleem underscore official, uh, to stay up to date. And I'll see you soon for more videos. Take it easy, guys. God bless. Bye-bye.